One of the coolest things about this keyboard is it has aftertouch, which for an instrument in this price range and an instrument this portable, that's hard to beat. It's thin enough so you can fit this really easily in a gig bag with a laptop, fly with it, and, and you're set. They've combined so many pieces into one unit, the small and portable. Portability factor is incredible. First thing I did when I got this, install the driver CD, boom, it all works and haven't had a single problem with it. Uh, it's reliable and stable and that, that's everything for me. You normally would need the keyboard, another you know, unit and the, the laptop. Now I can just you know, pull out a cord, plug it in here direct from the laptop and I'm, I'm cracky like it. I mean, it's great. The sound of it's unbelievable. I'm constantly being asked by sound guys at different TV shows like Saturday Night Live or Jay Leno and they're like, man, what kind of converters are you using? The, the loops are really punchy and sounding great. And uh, it's, it's been the M-Audio. I don't know what they're doing for converters in there because I know nothing about that stuff. All I know is it sounds good. So you can plug in uh, a mic, it's gonna sound great. Plug in a guitar, it's gonna sound great. And uh, plug in another synth or whatever you want, an effects box, anything, and you're off and running. This is like the ultimate companion for what I've been doing, especially with having two to three shows a day sometimes, and it's worked out really nice for me. Something that I really like about it is the ability to switch between presets within an application. So just think of this as a piece of clay, and by switching presets, you're actually changing the shape of this instrument. Obviously, the most fun thing on this is having a cool XY joystick controller, and it looks like Qbert too, so how can you not like it? This thing's killer for mapping two controllers at once, which is something we want to be able to do a lot as performers when we're out you know, playing electronic music live. Even in the studio, this is the kind of thing you want to do a lot. And you would typically have to have something like a chaos pad. It's more crap to carry with you if you're playing live. Um, so it's great, you got a built-in right here. With the Enigma software controller, it's, it goes unlimited. You can save different banks, you can save every control, all the zoning, the aftertouch assigning, every button, every knob can all be controlled through your computer, through a graphical interface. So if you're a guy like me that has a hard time looking at CC3216 and know what that means, you can just stick it up on the screen and visually assign how far you want this to stretch out to control this keyboard and it makes this life so much easier to be able to edit and see it all in one place. Again, it means less cables for all of us, you know? Um, you don't have to run a USB cable to your, your keyboard and then a firewire cable to your audio interface and then power to everything. You just have one cable here and it's firewire. They really thought of everything here. <laughs>